Hello, I'm Michael Blakey, and today we are talking about calendar time blocking and how you can be more calculated with your business endeavors and overall feel good at the end of the day knowing you accomplished all of your tasks. Time blocking. You've probably heard it hundreds of times, but today we're going to review my definition of time blocking. And so I consider it as you being as calculated as possible with every minute in your working day. So as you can see here, most people aren't calculated. So when they have goals, they're jumping between different items and not focused. So what takes a calculated individual eight hours to complete their whole day? It could take an uncalculated person 10 hours to complete their day. Take a look at this quote. I really value what this uh, gentleman shares. A 40-hour time-blocked work week, I estimate, produces the same amount of output as a 60-plus-hour work week pursued without structure. So being and using the uh, time-blocking method, you have a structured schedule so you know you're accomplishing all of your goals. Now at Clear to Close, we go in-depth on strategy review on how to maximize our goal time. And goal time is money-making activities such as prospecting, marketing, open houses, sending seller mailers, and so on. Our goal is every week to have at least 15 hours of goal time. Next is blue time. Blue time is business building activities. So that can be uh, continuing education courses, university courses at EXP University, meeting with lenders, title officers, new build reps, and so on. And finally, the other color is gray, and that is paperwork. So I have a really great friend in Tucson, Arizona. She is a top producer, probably the top 1% of all 1% producing agents in Tucson. She is an all around great person and personally a big time motivator. So she shared, keep it simple, use Google Calendar. You can label your events with color combos such as gold for golden activities, blue for business building, and gray for paperwork. Keep it simple, three to four is fine. Next, do all of your admin work in the morning. So that's the blue colors, that's uh, meeting with lenders, that's continuing education. So you have the rest of your afternoon to focus and maximize your golden hour. And her, uh, her goal is every day to meet with two individuals in the afternoon. I know a few teams here in Tucson that don't go home until they pass out between 10 and 15 business cards. And so those are all different examples on how you can maximize your golden activities. Now remember, you're just starting this method, and so it's not gonna be perfect on day one. As you are working it week in and week out, you're going to adapt how your schedule works to best suit your procedures. And finally, as you're inputting events, especially with your procedures or your meetings that are coming in the next day, or maybe you have a showing in an hour because a client says, hey, this was just listed, let's check it out in an hour. You might have that time in between so we have a few examples on what you can maximize every minute between those two events that could just be empty space you could send out emails you could reach out to uh, so or you can reach out to leads that just came in post a few social media posts and catch up on emails and you could see here that this is gold and blue all over with the intent to have a fully gold calendar or at least a week or day to maximize those money making activities now we'll go a week into the future and you can see that I have procedures every day between 8 and 8.45 ish I post on social media or schedule it between uh, 8.45 and 10 I'm on my database clear to close is standard within a year at clear to close we want you to have a database of 150 individuals because whether you're a doctor a real estate agent or a small business database is king and then you can see between 11 and 11.15, I'm interacting on social media. And then I have automatically Zoom meetings and uh, leadership meetings that happen weekly. And as we scroll down between 9 and 10, I have reading applied as well because I like to read every day and especially nonfiction business books. This book I'm currently reading is How to Win Friends and Influence People, and I try to read it once a quarter. Now, if we go back, you can see that between here, I'll use my mouse, between here and around the calendar there's those empty spaces that is where I will maximize that time where I don't have anything specifically scheduled and I can um, put in sending off emails reaching out to leads interacting on social media just making sure that my time on my working hours is maximized for the best result and within the last month and a half that I have been using the uh, time blocking strategy 
My following count on Instagram has gained about 100 followers per week. I have put over $1.2 million under contract and I'm building a group globally. And I feel like I have more time than ever because of the calendar time blocking. If you guys have any questions whatsoever, feel free to send me a message. I'm always here and willing to help and have a good rest of your day. Thank you.